Pet overpopulation has long been a challenge for South Florida neighborhoods. We receive so many calls and emails every single day from people that are um, they cannot keep their pets. Sometimes it's due to the economy. Sometimes um, it's because they're moving or they have a change of life. Um, and there are so many stray animals that we come across every single day. People bring strays to county shelters, but because of overcrowding, many animals don't survive their stay. About 30,000 animals are killed in Dane County alone every year, and many more are dumped. That's why organizations like the Homeless Pet Advocates work so hard to save the lives of dogs and cats in Miami-Dade and Broward counties. Without our organization, Responsible Rescues, so many more dogs would would be put to death needlessly because so many healthy, adoptable dogs are available. Today, the group teamed up with Compass Financial Federal Credit Union, the Pet Stop, and Neighbors for Neighbors for a pet extravaganza. We can save so many more lives if we could just get some dogs into foster homes. And we provide all the medical care, we can provide food if necessary. Um, all we ask is that a family brings them into their home and gives them the love and shelter and security that they need until they find their forever family. Placing pets in permanent, happy homes is a big goal, and today they've made some strides towards achieving it. I wasn't planning to get a dog, but I saw Ahi and decided we needed to add to our family. He'll have another playmate, and I hope to have a lot, a lot of years with fun, yes. My mom is going to fill out the application to adopt the dog. My favorite puppy is um, the little black one, Shusini. But adoptions aren't the only way to help homeless pets. Supplies are needed too. We have locations in South Florida, throughout South Florida to pick up or drop off that we can accept food, leashes, collars, bowls. So whether you're looking to add a four-legged friend to your family or just help another, a little bit goes a long way. For more information on pet fostering, adoption, and low-cost vaccinations, visit NeighborsForNeighbors.org. For Neighbors for Neighbors, I'm Nicole Maristani.